What's up, everybody? We got four more juices from VaporRenew.com to review. Um, this time we got the Creamy Nut Delight, the uh, Chocolate Cocoa Mocha, S'mores, and the Marshmallow Coffee Dream. Well, let's start off with the Creamy Nut Delight. It smells about like a um. Like a burnt peanut. I don't know, kind of weird smell to it. When I bake it though, it's a really damn good flavor. Um, I'm getting notes of toffee, uh, roasted nuts, uh, maybe a little hints of uh, like marshmallow cream or maybe some vanilla custard in there. Um, definitely has a several kind of different vanilla flavors to it. Um, mainly the main flavor that you'll get out of this though is a, a vanilla roasted nut. With a, a touch of maybe caramel and toffee. Um, really good vape. I, I can vape this all day, not get tired of it. Um, probably one of my favorites out of the eight flavors that I got from them. Um, as I said in my other review, um, probably the cheapest 30 mil bottles I've found so far. They have these little nutrition fact label on it. Tons of customization options like uh, throat hit intensifier, stuff like that. I'll give you a link so you can go check them out, like always. Full around with all the options that you can do. Um, but yeah, the Creamy Nut Delight, I would definitely recommend this if you're a fan of rusted nuts, toffee, and vanilla. Now, the uh, chocolate cocoa mocha, let's see how this smells. It has a pretty good smell to it. Um, it reminds me a lot of the chocolate coconut, though, that I find to be unvapable. Um, the 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 chocolate cocoa mocha, when I vape this one, I'm just getting notes of this bland, tart kind of chocolate. Uh, it doesn't really have much coffee or cappuccino or mocha taste to it. I mean, it's there, but you can barely, barely, barely taste it. Um, the chocolate, I think the chocolate is what's tasting kind of weird with uh, Vapor Renew's juices. So I would probably try to stay away from the chocolate in their juices. Um, I don't know what it is about this one. It's just it's kind of weird tasting. Um, almost right there with the um, the, the chocolate coconut. Um, I wouldn't recommend it because I just I probably I can't vape it. I'll probably give it to somebody that likes it. Um, the s'mores. Let's see how this one smells. Smells really good. Got notes of uh, graham cracker in there. When I vape it, um, it doesn't really taste like a s'mores, like you know, a real s'mores, like eating it. Um, I'm getting notes of uh, actually a good chocolate in this one, um, but as as you can see, it's like a, it's a light colored juice. It seems to be that their um, their darker colored juice is um, the ones that taste kind of funny. I don't know what it is with it, but um. The s'mores flavor, when I vape it, I'm getting notes of graham crackers, uh, a little bit of toffee in this one too. Um, it, the chocolate that's in it's really mild tasting, not really taste much chocolate at all in it. Um, I'm getting notes of vanilla custard in there. Um, it, it's quite an enjoyable vape. Um, I could vape it all day. I wouldn't compare, compare it to a real s'mores. But I would recommend this one if you if you like um, I want to say just uh, a graham cracker covered in chocolate with a touch of vanilla and um, a little bit of marshmallow flavor. Now the uh, marshmallow coffee dream. Let's see how this one smells. Kind of smells weird. Never really smelled a juice like this before. I guess it's the coffee in it making it smell like that. It does have a coffee smell to it. Um, it's kind of a, a weird color. It's like gray. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but it's kind of like a gray color to it. Um, when I vape this one, it's not a bad flavor though. Um, I couldn't vape it all day because it's kind of a weird tasting coffee in there. Um, it tastes about like taking a cup of black coffee and throwing some marshmallows in it. Then um, putting some, um, I don't know, like vanilla flavorings and stuff like that. When I vape it, the main taste I'm getting off of it is a 
kind of a tart bland coffee with uh, notes of a little bit of chocolate lots of marshmallow flavor in it um, kind of tastes like some cotton candy in it too maybe um, it's it's not a bad flavor but I just for me I can't vape it all day um, I could see some people loving it if they like a kind of a, a, a bland uh, in your face kind of coffee but uh, yeah, the main flavors, as I said, I'm getting off of it is uh, lots of marshmallow, lots of uh, coffee flavor, and like touches of vanilla. Um, maybe some, maybe the vanilla I'm tasting is like a cream flavor. But there you have it. Um, the uh, creamy nut delight tastes like toffee, um, caramel, um, roasted almonds, kind of. Um, it's just it's got lots of vanilla flavors and. It's a really unique juice. I, I definitely recommend going and trying this one out. I mean, for seven bucks for a 30 ml bottle, you can't really lose. The um, Choco Coco Mocha, really weird tasting. Wouldn't recommend this one. The s'mores doesn't really taste like a real s'mores, but you're getting nice nuts of graham crackers and chocolate, vanilla, and marshmallow. And the uh, Marshmallow Coffee Dream, as I said, lots of coffee and marshmallow flavor. I would recommend it if you're a fan of um, just raw, kind of rugged coffee flavors. Um, got all four of these from VaporRenew.com. I'll give you a link in the description so you can check them out. Go full around with all the customization options they have with Juice. Um, I guess that's it. Thanks for watching my review, and as always, vape on.